hello friends welcome back again uh, let us discuss an example today how to draw a dfa from a given regular expression right now suppose if this one is the given regular expression that is 0 plus 1 whole star followed by 0 1 what does it means first of all it means that at the starting of the string we can have any combination of zeros and ones star implies that it can be epsilon also right then followed by 0 and followed by 1 that means any string that is ended by 0 1 will belong to this particular regular expression let us look at some example let us say if I say string 0 0 1 so will this belong to the given regular expression yes if I write 0 1 this also belongs to the given regular expression because it is ending with 0 1 and before this we have a star here that denotes that it can be epsilon also right so epsilon 0 1 will be equivalent to 0 1 let us consider 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 this will also belong to the given language 1 1 1 0 1 belong to the given language 0 0 0 0 0 1 belong to the given language because all these strings are ending with 0 1 fine for example if we have a string 1 0 0 0 0 right so will this string belong to the given regular expression the answer is no this string will not belong to the given regular expression because it is ending in 0 0 but the regular expression should have but the string should have 0 1 at the last fine now how to draw a dfa for the given expression for this what we will do we will first of all draw a nfa or we say that we draw a fa so using the donations already discussed in my previous videos what we will do we will draw 0 plus 1 whole star so this is the easiest way that is 0 comma 1 star that means any combination of zeros and 1 can be found by this particular string as we are doing it on the initial state so epsilon will also be fine can also be considered next comes 0 and then comes q1 q1 with 1 will go to q2 and that one will become the final state fine so everything which is given in the regular expression has been denoted in the particular nfa fine now let us take any string if we take 0 1 it is accepted 0 1 accepted right so that means this belongs to the fa as well can be accepted by fa 0 0 1 so 0 0 1 0 fine so how it will be taken 0 0 1 fine so it will also be accepted if you look at all those strings which we were considered before for the belongingness to the given regular expression these strings are also accepted by the formulated nfa now for its conversion to dfa we can use the process nfa to dfa conversion which we have already discussed right so as of now this is the easiest method to draw a fa from the given regular expression fine as on as and when we will move on with the examples we can directly draw the gfa dfa by using the given regular expression right so that's it for today i hope that the given example is clear to you if you have any further doubts or query please mention in the comments below we will definitely get back to you thank you for watching this video